I'm just like, let the frustration commence. Oh, I can't wait. It might not be that bad. But from what I've read, it's it's not a good sign. Uh, not really. Right, I'm just going to do this to check it out first. Ooh, this is fucking spooky. How big is this place? Oh. Oh, that is weird. Jet. <laughs> ah. Oh, I know this is gonna suck. I mostly just want to see what will happen. Not really bothered about fighting him. I'm just wanting to know what happens if I die. Does it act as a normal death? Or... Do it not. Oh my. Uh, I do remember this though. Yep, I am going to die. Nightmare King Grim. Oh, I actually took up the full screen. Jesus. Holy fuck, you are fast. Jesus Christ almighty. Oh man, that's such a, such a cheap thing. Either way, I'm not bothered. Kill me. Cool. Oh, perfect. That still doesn't really help, but that's quite nice. Okay. Fuck. I'm just trying to think, is it worth it? <laughs> is it worth it just to get the fully upgraded Dream Child? Oh, I'm just a, such a conflict. With so many things with this game. I love it and I really want to show more off of it, but it, it's really quite challenging. I don't know if I'll be able to get to use that all that much. You don't stick around for long enough to be able to use soul. Either way. Fragile. Strength, because it won't break, so that's good. Quick slash, don't know if that'd be useful. Blood core. That's what I want to do. Oh, you're not able to heal yourself, that's right. Barrier strength will increase. I'm probably not going to be healing all that much. Or more so, be able to heal. That's the force of the bearer's nail, we're not really that useful. Sod knows. Whatever. I mean, Grim can kill me in four hits. Fun. <laughs> I'll just give it a good a couple amount of tries. Probably won't succeed. That's fine. I'll just go over to um I can't remember what it's called. The Hollow Knight, I think. Is what he's called. Instead. Do, 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 do. Does it do that every time I come here then? I really should just use the crystal thing, but whatever. Is it every time it does it? Dun dun dun! Oh my god, it does. That's cool. Wow, alright. That's got one hell of a fucking range. Okay, okay. Jesus Christ. Okay, he does the fucking fire bats. Yep, again. Jesus. Oh my god. No wonder Nightmare Grimm's, uh... Whew. A doozy. Jesus. You really have to be able to read him. Like, in an instant. I would say I have quick reflexes. This is just something else. <laughs> I like the music, though. I'm glad it's got a good, good, good song. Still do not have much hope of doing fucking anything though. Fuck's sake, I should just learn to get in the middle. Wow, good job. Good job. Oh my god. Oh dear. Woo. Dear the fucking fire. Oh Jesus, the bats. Oh, he's got so many different attacks. Oh dear. 
How many mask shards till nine masks? One. And I'm not doing it. <laughs> it's one where you've got to get a, a flower and deliver it to a place in Queen's Gardens without taking any damage. And as soon as I figured that out, I was like, yep, fuck this. Also, nine mask guard masks would just mean I'd survive one more hit, which really would not have me last very long. He does do the same thing every time. Oh dearie me. Jesus. Fuck me. And the bats got me again. Jesus. It's not that hard. I don't care, dude. <laughs> I'm not doing it. I mean, if you manage to do it, awesome. That's great for you. I don't even know how many more tries to give Nightmare Grim. I'll go with three more tries. If I can't do it, which I probably won't, then I don't mind. <laughs> you know, what, what matters is the fact I tried. Okay, Jesus. Fuck me. Deary me. Fuck the bats. Okay. That was a mistake. That was just not a good idea. Oh dear. Whew. Fuck. Fuck. Well, I can survive one hit. Oh no, not this. And I died. Fuck. I mean, whether or not it's useful does not change the fact that I'm not going to do it. Whoosh! So, two more tries. Whew! Bum bum. Bum bum. I fucking failed and missed. Oh dear. Jesus. That was not something I expected to have happen, man. Oh, I didn't think it was doing that. I thought it was sending out the bats. Whew. Oh, fuck the fire pillars things. I jumped into him. That happens too much. Ah. No, 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 no. I didn't jump high enough. And I died. <laughs> Fuck! Oh my god. I mean, I'm kind of getting used to his pattern. Does not mean I'll be able to get through it any easier, but I am getting used to it, kind of. The only thing I'm not, I've not really seen much of is the part where you've got to dodge the fireballs. And they seem to be a lot faster. That's the only problem. Fuck me. Jesus. I keep forgetting he does it high low, high low. Fuck. Great. Ah, oh, damn. That was my final attempt. <sighs> Once more. I will stick to my word at some point. That was one hell of a pitiful attempt, though. I went down in an instant. I just pff, lost all kinds of skill. I mean, he's not called the Nightmare King for nothing. Oh, you are a dick. Changed up your moves and everything. Oh, Jesus. Ah. Whoa, okay. Fuck me. Oh my god. Ah, shit. Oh. I keep forgetting when he's gonna do that. Ah. Why, wow, I walked into it. Oh my god, I'm so good. <laughs> Alright, that's. I think that's enough. Jesus.
Why am I Grim? You, you don't get about. God. I gave it, I gave it the old college try. Whew. Oh my god. The game really does just like, increase. I don't know, tenfold. In terms of like, requirement of skill. It's honestly, impressive. Like, because anybody can start the game and beat, you know, the False Knight and all those. Hornet and whatever. It's only when you get into the later game when it really starts to test your metal. I like it. Uh, I don't need both of these. It's kind of a waste. Defender's Crest is really not all that useful anymore. All I can hear is fucking zoked. Aklava Bootis. Don't really need those. Really. Sprint Master is useful for moving fast. That's about it. Uh, I might actually go with Sprint Master and my Shadow Dash. Sharpie Shadow. Ah. Oh, I got them on my map. So. I may just go at the Forgotten Crossroads. See what that leads to. I mean, if it leads to the end of the game, then. It leads to the end of the game. I am interested. Wow, great. Hmm. I'm interested in dying. Because that's more, more than likely what's gonna happen. Holy fuck. Well, this place changed. Holy infection, Batman. You ain't getting me. Buckaroo. I looked away for a second. Jesus. Yes, kill these, please. Thank you. Right, I should have enough. No, I don't. Crap. I just, I just want full soul. That's all I want. Well, actually, no. I want full health. That's what I want. Where the hell am I? Oh, yeah. This is where there was a grub. Oh, my God. This guy's fine. Whoa. That's incredible. That's impressive. He died. Perfect. I haven't seen those guys in a while. I've also... The only one I've seen is the one that's, like, overcome with infection and doesn't move. That's the only one. Oh well. So what the heck's in here? I mean, I know it's what was sealed inside. Temple of the Black Egg. Oh! Very nice. Whatever. Temple of the Black Egg. God. I can remember when I first came into here. Even if there wasn't a bench before the fight, it doesn't really matter. There's a bench in Dirtmouth, which is seconds away. Oh, I love this. Darkness. More darkness. Oh, lots of darkness. Ooh. Aha! Phew! Perfect. Vessel, though bound, you shall know the state of the world. Hollow Nest will be whole again. Oh! My completion percentage. 99%. Holy shit! That's a lot higher than I thought. Like, a whole lot higher than I thought. I thought I would end this with like, I don't know, 60%. I mean, I've not done the DLC and stuff, which, I mean, probably doesn't count towards completion. That's still a shitload higher than I thought it would be. That's, that's quite nice. Beats my Yakuza completion rates. Those were like 4%. <laughs> that's because I blasted through the main story and didn't focus on side stories. It was really quite stupid. Oh, God. That thing, that is looking at me. All right, you creepy bitch. What I should do is attack the nail and break it so he's useless. 112%. 
Yeah, I ain't getting that ever. Even still, I'm happy I got 99% completion on my first playthrough. Damn straight. Oh, damn right. I'm pretty damn fucking happy about that. Oh dear. I don't like this. There he is. Oh, fuck. The Hollow Knight. Oh god, I don't know what he does. Ah! Okay. Fuck me. Shit. I dashed into him. Good job. Fuck. Oof. I thought I'd have time. <laughs> I thought I would have had time to heal. Sheesh. I need to remember that you don't really get that much time to heal and stuff. Oh dear. Yep. <sighs> Great. Pogo that led to, not death, <laughs> led to getting hurt. Uh. Oh dear. Oh shit. That, I don't even know how much that did. A lot. Okay. Oh dear. What the fuck? I'm confused. Oh god. Uh. Why is the music so, like, sad? Oh dear. Ah! Fuck. Hit me with your corruption bullshit. Oh god, he floats. Ah! <gasps> what the fuck? Yeah, this is so weird. Great. Oh, I died. Fuck. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> For the first try against him, I don't think I did too badly. Could have done better, I could have won, but yeah. Wait, where's my shade? Ah, there you are. Hello, my friend. No, oh, you downward fucking dick. Wow, I'm getting hit by my own shade. Wow, I'm going into this. Two masks down. I'm screwed. Do I have to unleash him every time as well? No, I don't. Alright. There he is, again. I'm surprised- he's quite fucking tall. Oh, wow, good job. Pfft. Oh my god, I'm doing so much worse. Ooh. Boing, boing, boing. Ah, shit. Shit. This happens when you don't hit a hitbox. Yeah! Fuck you! I mean, I could use my techniques, but eh. I've never really mastered those. I would only flub and fuck up. Ah. No, you don't. I want to heal. Really want to heal. Now I can heal. No, I can't. Never mind. Forget it. I wanted to heal. Oh dear. Fuck! Right, well I now know that does two masks of damage. Which is what I thought it did. Oh dear. Ah. Ah. Don't know why that spooked me so much, but it did. Okay, now it just stabs itself a lot. Which I'm fine with. Oh god. Oh, I walked into it. I should not be stood on top of him. Fuck. Okay. I mean, if you want to keep doing it, then then sure, I guess. Fuck. Oh dear. Was that it? 
Did he, did he die? Oh dear. Oh, of course. Wait. I'm focusing the infection? That sounds like a really bad idea. Oh my god. Whoa. Oh my god. Oh Jesus. Now that's gonna seal him. Oh wow, that was the end. Oh my god. Team Cherry. Wow. Is this the only game they've made? So far. As if it is. Wow. That was, <laughs> this was so good. Like, I've never, I've not really been I don't want to say I've not been a huge fan of uh, Metroidvanias. It's more the fact I've never really had the opportunity to play many. Like, I played the Castlevanias, like Symphony of the Night, which is probably the most... Well, not maybe what... Maybe not well-known. But one of the more known Metroidvanias. And also the Metroid games. But, you know, I've, I've only played very little of them. So this was probably the first time I've ever, like, fully played a metroidvania which probably shows because it took me a very long time to get through it because I just wanted to explore everything and there were so many times I just kept going back through areas I've I'd already been through found new things to do uh, it's just I don't know something about it is so good it's just such a great feeling when you you know when you get a new a new item such as I'm trying to think of what one is a good example the Monarch Wings, I guess. Like, when you get that, it opens up so much more, and then you realize, like, holy shit, I can now get over here. I can get over here. I don't know, it's just, it's really cool, and it also kind of plays on your memory, too. Because you have to remember, where was there a part where I had to double jump? Oh, where, where were those ba- um, not banners. Where were those things that made it so... I can't fucking think of the words I'm trying to think. There weren't portals. They weren't banisters. They were like void gates, something like that, whatever. And when you get the shadow cloak, you can shadow dash through them. Though they, they... They fucked me up so much. Like coming across the shadow gates, void gates, whatever you want to call them. Wow, that's a lot of backers. Yeah, when I first came across them, I was just like, oh, I must have to get an item to, like, dispel these. I thought it was like the dream nail that I needed. Wow. Congratulations, well done on achieving this great feat. You persevered, and you triumphed. We hope you enjoyed yourself in the world of Hollow Knight, and we'll meet again soon on the road ahead. Team Cherry. Wow. If that was their first game they made, I'm incredibly looking forward to whatever it is they make next. Do not care what kind of game it is. I'm really looking forward to whatever it is they make. Because, as I say, if this was their first ever game, then holy fuck. Game completion percentage, 99%. Yeah, it took me 26 hours. You damn right I did. Steel Soul. No shade, no reviving. Death is permanent. Nah, no, I'm not that much of a masochist. In fact, I think it would be less painful to sit on a cactus bare arsed. Wow. There's actually people that have completed this game on Steel Soul mode. 
You know, when you think about stuff like that, it just makes you feel incredibly incompetent. It's like, I'm so happy with what I managed to do. You got people beating the game in steel soul mode. Man! Where's the... not that. I can't remember what it is. What, what, what's it under? It's not under that either. It's under extras! I'm an idiot. <laughs> there we are, menu style. Infected, Void Heart, Classic, Hidden Dreams, Grim Trope, Troop, Lifeblood, and Godmaster. I think I, I actually started the game... Like, when I started this playthrough, it was on Godmaster. And then, I don't know, there must have been an update. It might have been when the consoles... When the console uh, versions came out, maybe. That my menu changed to Void Heart. And again, that might have coincided when I went to the Ancient Basin 2. Not entirely sure. Either way, this game was, wow, so incredible. Really, so incredible. Can I actually go back into my game then? Okay, it saves just before you fight Hollow Knight. Interesting. Huh, wow, I don't really know what to do. I'm tempted to go in and just fight Nightmare Grim just to put this up to an hour. But, is there really a point? I don't think there is. I didn't expect the, it only to last an hour. Not really. I would say I kind of just... I didn't really give up. It was more the fact I had my mind set on completing the game. And so I did. It wasn't the fact I skipped on a bunch of stuff. Like, the Coliseum of Fools I didn't complete. Mostly because that third challenge w was just frustrating for me. Um, I couldn't defeat Nightmare Grim. I probably could if I sat there and bashed my head against it for three hours. But I don't really want to do that on recording. Because that would be mind-numbingly boring. As you watch my slow descent into insanity. So yeah, I didn't, I didn't really fancy doing that. Which is why I gave it, I don't know, six or seven tries. I'd, I'd say I, I made some pretty good progress in those tries. There were some attempts that just were over before they even started, but then others that went quite well. Um, I'm trying to think of what, what else didn't I manage to do? I didn't get the true ending, which I don't care, because as I said, the only way you'd know about the true ending is by looking it up. Or at least that's what I think. Unless there's like some hidden lore in the game that you could uncover the, the true ending or something. But I know the true ending's to do with the, the Path of Pain. You get the other half of that I don't know what it is, it's like a white orb. And then once you've gotten that, it allows you access to the birthplace. The birthplace is where you can get access to some sort of charm. I can't remember what it is. It's a charm that once you get it, you can't remove it. And that allows you to fight the Radiance, which is the true, true boss. And an absolute bitch as well. I only know of these things because of me being an idiot and watching a Hollow Knight Toughest Bosses video. <laughs> I got interested because I was like, yeah, I fought that. I can't remember how far into the game I was. I think I'd only just beaten the Soul Master. So I'd only beaten like three bosses at that point. Maybe a few more. No, I'd probably beaten about six or seven actually. And so I was just curious as to where they were on the list. And watching that video was dumb because it kind of spoiled a few things. The fact that there was a true boss. Or true ending or something, which whatever. Anyway, I've been rambling for a very long time to kind of pad out the end of this game. But either way, I'm happy with how this ended. Like, my first playthrough resulted in a 99% completion, which is 13% off of true 100% completion. So in that regard, I got 87%, which I'm still happy about. It took me 26 hours. Sheesh. Either way, that is going to be, going to be the end of Hollow Knight. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have enjoyed this adventure. This truly, truly incredible adventure. And until next time, take care.